Hey y'all, I posted a video of this abalone nail swatch on my Instagram stories and some of you asked for a tutorial, so here it is. I start with just a single layer of the Presto White Art Gel. I prefer this instead of Cocoist Bluey White for this, just because it's a little bit warmer. When I'm done with that coat, I cure it in the lamp for 60 seconds. For the next step, I do a thin layer of Cocoist White Gradation, which is just a sheer buildable white. Uh, and while that's still wet, I kind of swipe a little bit of Cocoist uh, Black Martini in to that wet layer. Um, so Black Martini is kind of like a sheer grayish, blackish situation, and that helps to give a little bit of the dimension of the shell. And then while it's still wet, I take a liner brush and do just a couple thin strokes of Blackest Black, and then I kind of like feather it out a little bit with some isopropyl alcohol. And then I cure that. Next I apply some foil transfer gel and cure that for 60 seconds. So the secret to the whole look is using one of these oil slick translucent transfer foils from AliExpress is where I got mine. And while the Foil transfer gel is curing. I just like to wipe both sides of it with a little bit of alcohol because I can't tell which side is the back at this point, and it just helps the design transfer a little bit more evenly. Before I transfer the foil, I just kind of line up the design at an angle so it kind of matches the angle of that underpainting. And once the backing's kind of separating, I just lift it up, and there you go. Before I encapsulate the foil, I just paint a few lines with white gradation on top, kind of in between where those black lines are in the underpainting. I feel like this just helps everything kind of blend together instead of feeling like the transfer foil is just sitting on top of all the background. So you could just call it done at this point and encapsulate it, cure that, and then hit it with a non-wipe top coat, but I'm a little bit of a nut, so I hit it with a non-wipe top coat, and then I add a little bit of this green iridescent pigment powder and kind of rub that into the cured non-wipe top coat, and then I encapsulate that, and then I throw on a top coat, and then she's done. So it looks kind of sick. If you use this tutorial, tag me. I'd love to see it. See you later.